hiking taken to a whole new level underground. The mines here in the Black Hills are quite popular with hikers. Part of the intrigue is generated by old rusty mining structures that seem to come alive with every eerie gust of wind. While the building is interesting, the mine itself is a whole nother experience. There's, it's just so peaceful and quiet in here. It's dark. It's an escape from everyday life. Behind me is the entrance to one of the more popular mines here in the Black Hills for hikers, but just because it's popular doesn't necessarily mean that it's safe. Mines are not a good place to play. Frank Carroll is retired now, but spent 31 years with the U.S. Forest Service. And for the most part, they're wonderful. They're, they're fun to visit. They're very interesting to look at. They can also be dangerous. So the entrance to the actual mine is just over there. But before you get there, there's this mine shaft that looks like just a puddle. But listen to this. That is several, several feet down. These mine edits fill up with water. And if you're in there when it's raining or there's been rain upstream from you, you could be trapped and, and drowned by water. Uh, you have to be careful where you step and what you're getting yourself into. Some of these old tunnels will collapse. Carol says there are thousands of mines in the hills filled with rich history, the sort of thing people should have the opportunity to experience. Look at the outside, dream about what it must have been like, but quell your curiosity and don't go into holes that you haven't been in before. Still, some curiosity can't be quelled. No, not at all. I feel perfectly safe in here. Nick Reagan, Coda Territory News.